Question 56. Which one of the following is the best estimate of the chance that the first child of an Australian couple chosen at random has cystic fibrosis? So first things first, we've got to figure out the chance that um, two heterozygous people for the cystic fibrosis uh, allele meet in the first place and have a child. So uh, the... Uh, chance that a uh, strain is a carrier of the defective value, i.e. is heterozygous, is 1 in 20. So the um, chance, therefore, that two heterozygous people um, meet is going to be equal to 1 on 20 times 1 on 20. So that is going to equal to 1 on 400. Now, um, the chance that a heterozygous couple meets and has a um, child with cystic fibrosis is going to be 1 on 4 because um, if we draw out our Punnett square basically um, if we list big N as like the normal allele because that's dominant to the um, recessive defective cystic fibrosis allele which we label as little n um, well if we have two heterozygous people the chances of a homozygous recessive value coming out is going to be 1 on 4. So therefore, we need to times this uh, 1 on 400 of chance by 1 on 4 to figure out the chance that um, a couple chosen at random will have a child with cystic fibrosis. <clears throat> so therefore, the correct answer for question 56 is C.